The mood was somber, and a deafening reality hit as the audience listened to the words from a famous letter penned by Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. from the Birmingham jail. The honor and legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. was celebrated at CSU Bakersfield with a series of events to commemorate the 50th anniversary of his assassination. The director of the Kegley Institute of Ethics, Dr. Michael Burroughs, introduced the letter. A central portion of King's uh, vision and uh, message was that of the beloved community. Those in attendance were welcome to the podium to take part in the reading of the letter. In an organized manner, one by one, each person read a paragraph or two from the letter, while the rest of the audience listened carefully. Dr. Burrell said he was pleased with the outcome of the event. I mean, I think what's really cool about the event today is it's not just a lecture, it's, it's people reading, it's people actively stepping up and coming to, coming to the podium to, to take part in the, in the process. Um, and I think so, it's on those two levels, you know, that was kind of the goal of the event. And I think we, I think we definitely achieved that, I thought it was wonderful. The audience was reminded that Dr. King's legacy still lives on and everyone has a role to play in the fight for justice and equality. And it leaves the message behind that I think ties to the letter in the Birmingham jail is that we all have a role as activists. We all have a role to be involved in social justice and community and that it's not just a leader, that it takes a team to get something done when we want to make change, particularly in the world. I'm Glendi Ardon for Runner News Network.